this is one of my benchtop power supplies I made it with a computer power supply the case is a regulator case a power regulator DC regulator in fact and I put these two meters some switches and a buck converter into it right now it's the meters is powered by 5 volts this button here puts the benchtop power supply on this one controls this and that and when you turn this knob you get 3.5 volts you get 5.2 volts and you get 12.1 volt when you put this side on you get 11.3 since this is 12 you won't get 12 here there is a buck converter inside of it which brings down the voltage when you turn this knob as you can see the voltage is dropping let me demonstrate that for y'all if I put this light here and this here this is the light let me put off this side this is the light right now I have one point seventeen amps the current getting out at 2.9 volts now if I increase the voltage while I'm increasing the voltage you can see the light it gets brighter it won't go up to the 11 amps 11 volts because of what the light is drawing if I decrease the voltage You see it drops down while you increase the voltage this light comes on to tell you you're increasing the voltage and the bulb starts glowing the voltage comes up the 
light gets brighter. This is that side, it goes down to 1.5 and the current is 11.5. This is the, the, the 12 volt side. As you can see, the bulb is bright. Watch the meter here. It's at 11.6 because of a current, the current draw. If I take over that, you'll see it's 12, 12.1. Put it back, it goes to 11.6. Flick the switch, 5.2. Flick the switch again, the 3 volts, 3.4, and it's off. power off right now I'll show you all inside the power supply let me get this out of the way Let me move the camera. Let me unplug the cable at the back. I took out the screws. So I will not boil in taking out the screws. Let me open the top. I put this and that here because of the buck converter this is the buck converter here let me see if i could get y'all Yeah, this is the buck converter. I put a heat sink on it, which I ordered from Amazon with some sticky glue. When using it for a period of time, it gets very hot. So I put, the cover has some vents here. I put this pad in inside the top and on one of the sides to control the airflow into the bench top power supply. I put this here, I attach the fan at the back which there wouldn't be space for it inside 
it has a built-in fuse and this is what my wiring management is like I hope you can see this this is what the unit is This is my bench top power supply. If you find this video was helpful, please give me a like. And subscribe. Click on the bell icon to be notified of further uh, videos oh it has I put a fuse right here so it's well protected I put this for if in case I enter in it ch checking on anything that I won't be electrocuted so this is it for now if you find this video was helpful please subscribe and click on the bell icon so you'll be notified of further videos thank you